As Bozeman schools get ready to close shop for the summer, the Bozeman Public Library is gearing up to take over with their summer learning program. All of our programs are based around play and joy and letting kids do what kids do best, which of course is playing and learning, telling stories, um, being creative and exuberant. Head of Youth Services at the Bozeman Public Library, Ellie Newell, says there's a phenomenon out there called the summer slide. It's where kids who are not reading and learning over the course of the summer begin to lose some of their educational attainment. And then when they go back to the into school in the fall, they've um, have to relearn things that they'd learned the previous year. That's where the library summer learning program comes into play, she says. And I say it comes into play quite literally. Because there is a full summer itinerary at the library where not only children but people of all ages can create summer fun, diving into new experiences and skills that will last a lifetime. So this summer uh, I'm really excited about a lot of the science, technology, engineering, art, and mathematics programs that we'll be offering at the library. Newell says she's also looking forward to some of the upcoming programs in collaboration with Tinworks Art, Montana Fish, Wildlife, and Parks, the Raptor Center, and the Museum of the Rockies. For over 50 years, the library has been hosting their summer learning program. In the past, the program included free lunches through a federal U.S. Department of Agriculture program that is administered by the State Office of Public Instruction. This year, though, we are unable to be a host site for free lunch this summer. The program qualifies locations to give away free lunches in the summer to children based on neighborhood income. The library's neighborhood is unfortunately um, no longer eligible. But the free lunch program will still be offered at other locations in and around Bozeman. You can visit our website to learn where. It's really beautiful to be a place where kids are, um, kids' curiosities are honored. In Bozeman, Jolie Salib, MTN News.